What's going on everyone? My name is Impulse and welcome back to Hermitcraft. Yep, I'm wearing a dunce cap this episode and I don't have a beard because of it. And I did notice something. Check this out. If I take these off, look at the, the hat says H on it, which I'm guessing stands for Hermit. And then look at my shirt says I on it because Impulse. It says hi. So, hi. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's us this episode. We're going to be wearing the, the dunce cap, the whole thing. The whole thing. Um, also, remember last episode we did the, the content generator and we drew these pieces of paper? You remember what they were? Vault, Multiply, and Azuma. So, I've been thinking about it. What can we do? What can we do with the vaults and Multiply and Azuma? And I think I have a plan. You see, I also happened to wander by the statue the other day when we accepted our dunce cap thing. And remember, there was another one over here that has a host, a royal event, i.e. feast or party. And I've been thinking about it, thinking, is there a way I can combine Vault, Multiply, Azuma, and hosting a royal event into one thing? and get some profit here. So, I have an idea. <laughs> We're gonna use Ren's Vault for a party. Perfect. And not just any kind of party. We're gonna have a costume party. You see, I'm gonna have all the hermits dress up as Azuma. And then that would therefore multiply Azumas. Oh. Uh-oh. What was that noise? This is Ren's Vault. I was planning on using it down there for the party. I'm... I'm hearing something though. What is that? Uh oh. Uh oh, that's probably not good. Oh gosh, we're blinded. Um ugh, gonna be kinda hard to have a party when there's a warden in the vault. Uh oh. <laughs> well, that might make things a little more difficult. Um yeah, it's gonna be hard to have a good time in there when, when that guy's roaming around. We might have to do something with him. I uh, might have to escort him out for the evening during the party, but I'm not too worried about it. We're kind of experts in escorting wardens around the server, so yeah, I'll just keep him somewhere safe, and we can still use this place to have a good time. So that is my plan. I think I'm going to go ahead and go back and put my head in that barrel, and we'll accept the quest. And <laughs> we killed two birds with one stone. All right. It's up to us now to host a royal event. Is that new? I think this is new. Priority adventure. Oh, I see. I see. Somebody here has found a loophole. Yeah, I found out that the priority quests I did last episode actually weren't declared by Ren the King himself. They were actually quests that Grian had put together. So now that those have been outlawed, yep, thou shall not make quests. Doesn't say anything about adventures though, does it? Which means we are free to take on whatever this is as well. Adventure, not quest. <laughs> Ask Grumbot what to do. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so in order to figure out what this adventure is, we have to go ask Grumbot. Yeah, uh, another six diamond blocks. I'm racking up the diamonds here. These quests have been very lucrative for me. But before we visit Grumbot to see what that's all about, I think I better get some royal invitations out to let the hermits know that we're going to have this party in the vault. So here we go. Uh, I'm writing them these invitations. I'll get one of these handed out to all the hermits. And it says, Dear Hermit, I, Impulse, have accepted a king's quest to have a royal event. I hereby invite thee to a royal costume party to occur in the king's vault in the castle. Here's the coordinates. On Wednesday, September 7th, 7 p.m. BST. This will be a themed costume party, so please show up wearing your favorite Azuma costume. Beverages and sacks will be served, and there will be games with prizes to win. Hope to see you there. All right, so I just need to make a bunch of these invitations and go hand them out. All right, all the invitations have been handed out, and now that means we've got to deal with this guy. Where is he at? Let's go free cam, see if we can find... There he is. Yeah, um, I kind of want to have the party in the vault in this room, so he's definitely way too close. I think what we'll have to do is just give him a little tunnel to go down 
and uh, coax him out of here for a little while, and then we can always bring him back in. It looks like Ren had a quest to bring the warden in here that's been completed by a Cub and Azuma, I believe, and uh, we'll, we'll bring him right back after the party's over since this is where he's supposed to be. All right, I think I have a plan. I was taking a look at how Cub and Azuma got this warden in here in the first place, and they used a water stream right there to lift him up. And I was thinking, what if we did the opposite? We actually switch it to pull him down. And all we need to do is maybe put in some pistons and swap it out with a magma block instead of a soul sand, and that will suck him down. However, he might start taking damage, so we might want to then switch it again with another block and kind of stop him from going back up. So that's my goal right now. And also my goal is to not die because I think even from here, he can probably sonic charge me and that's why I keep backing up. So um, I might just dig this a little bit deeper to just make sure I can stay away. In fact, if we free cam it, yeah, I'm getting blindness immediately. And um, yeah, there he is. But you can see he's actually right by this bubble column. So if we swap it out, he might get sucked down right away. Ooh, okay, okay. Might be a little too close right there. Ooh, okay, still too close. This might be easier if we get him focused on something else. So I think I'm gonna try the piston trick to make some noise and see if we can draw him to it. And I'll go as far away on this side as I can to give us a little bit of time to set it up. And here we go, like that, and like that, and there we go, Piston, and hopefully he'll focus on that. Let's see if he gets drawn over to it. Doesn't seem to be drawn to it. Maybe it's too far away. I might have to go down there and kind of lure him over a little bit. Uh, this could definitely go wrong. If we put the Piston on the inside there. Okay, he's slowly making his way over. Come on, buddy. This way, over here. Here he comes. Oh. There, he just picked up sound from the piston. Okay, we're gonna be silent. Now, how am I gonna get out of here without making noise? We got no choice. Okay. Okay, I think we're out. All right, let's go down and check on our friend. There we go. That's what we were hoping for. <laughs> He's getting punched in the face by a piston over and over again. Almost feel a little bad about this. Okay, so hopefully that means we can finish setting up without him trying to attack us. And I think so. It sounds like he's still over there. And I'm thinking we just drop him down a little bit further here just to make sure he's out of range of the party. Not giving anyone a blindness effect and all that. And so, yeah, we'll put it about right here, maybe. Magma block is in place. It looks like bubbles are sucking down the current here. And when he comes through, he should just be washed to the end of this hallway. And, um... How will we get him back up there? That's a problem for future me. I'll deal with that later. But I do think what I'll do is I send a redstone signal. I will push this stone block in place after he's been sucked down and starting to move over just to make sure he doesn't continue or find his way back to get damage. I would hate for this guy to die and have to go catch another one on my own to put in here. So yeah, I got a little bit of redstone. Let me see, get my torch. So now I actually have to coax him to go into this one wide hole. And we go. Let's see, will he continue to just focus on this right now? Well, now he probably will focus on me since I took away his noise machine. And we need to lure him over here now. I feel like he's actually stuck on these observers. Oh, there we go, we made some noise. Oh, he's gonna shoot us. All right, there's the bubbles right there. So we gotta get him over to here. Here he comes. Oh, we're gonna get shot. I'm out. Oh, we did get shot. Let's take a look with our free cam here. Oh, he's getting super close. Super close, come on. Oh, he's right above the hole. I see him up there. Come on, buddy. Just a little further. Oh, he is so close. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. I'm gonna die. Ah! Yep, there it is. Oh, man. Thank you, Totem. Okay, that went swimmingly. <laughs> Let's check on him. There it is. Exactly where I wanted him. <laughs> oh, it worked. You know what? He'll be fine. 
All right, now it's time. Let's go see if the vault is now friendly once again. Well, seems like it. I mean, I can hear them a little bit, but that's not too big of a deal. I wonder if anybody falls down here. Are they close enough to get the blindness effect? Nope, seems okay. All right, looks like it's time to set up for a party. All right, first things first. What is a party without music? And I think I have the perfect music disc for it. No, 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 no. I think you mean yes, yes, yes. Now that the music's taken care of, we need to check out this space. We need a room to set up some beverages and some food. And also, if we're going to be playing some games in here, I think we're going to need a little bit more space. So I'm going to do some building out temporarily so that we have a little bit of room to mingle in here. I think what I'll do is just move his diamonds out of the way, store it in a chest here, put a sign on it, and we'll just say party favors, one per person. Well, we've made this place a lot more festive here, as you can see. We've got our Izuma Void, or Multiply maybe, banners on the wall, some balloons floating. I put in a little temporary floor here so that uh, we'll have some room to roam around without worrying about falling down into his little pit, which means I'm gonna have to take it out later, but that's okay. We've got a refreshment stand all set up to go with our suspicious stews, our cookies and cakes, and of course I got a cake set out to use as well as our jukebox kind of hidden in here because we're gonna need it to play some musical boats or, you know, musical chairs, but we're using boats. So in fact, we've already had someone demonstrate. <laughs> He's practicing here. He's demonstrating our musical boats for us. And the idea is that we'll be playing some music. Hermits will be going around and around and there'll be one less boat than there are hermits. And if they don't get in the boat when the music stops, they're out of the game. Most of you probably know how that works. But because we are playing a game, I thought it'd be nice to give away a little prize to the winner. And I've been thinking about what kind of prize can we give? My first thought was, well, we're gonna collect a shard, right? The royal shards or whatever they're called for this. Maybe we give away one of those. So I'm gonna go grab it. I know it's early, but I'm gonna grab it now. That'll be one of our rewards. So the quest crystal or shard or whatever you call it, it it's a good prize, but I don't think it's enough. So I was actually thinking the main prize could be a discount to what's gonna be my mega shop, which by the way, I think I finally settled on a name for it. I'm gonna call this iBuy, right? Gotta stay on brand. The, the letter I and then buy, B-U-I, iBuy. So I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a 50% off coupon for iBuy and we're gonna make it pretty mega because this coupon is gonna be all items all season long. That is one heck of a deal because we're gonna have so many items in there that they're gonna be able to save a ton of diamonds over the course of the season. So yeah, I buy 50% off coupons for the winners. And I got a couple games planned out and I think I'll just make a couple of those coupons right now. All right, I have returned with the prizes and I got a few of them because we're gonna be playing a few games here. And I think now it's ready to go. There's one last thing I need to do. I myself am gonna need a costume for this party. Well, I suppose this'll work. Squid Zuma. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, yeah, you may notice I put my little eye logo on the front. You can barely see it. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. All right, well, it's time. It's party time. I'm going to call the hermits over, and let's get this show on the road. Welcome, everybody. This is a great turnout. I think this is our first ever <laughs> royal event. Look Ooh. at everybody looking Ooh. dapper. Ooh. There's so many Azumas. Everybody, everybody bring their Azuma Ooh. costume. We looking good? Yeah. Everybody. And there's the, there's hey, Azuma. Hey, there, there he is. Hey, hey, hey there's hey, Azuma. Hey, hey. What's going on? We well, started a secret cult in yeah. honor of you. Yeah. Is this the part where we right. do circles around him, like with, with the yeah. Azuma? His name is Azuma. <laughs> Boy. His name is Azuma. Boy. <laughs> We're having a costume party. Okay. I see you, you came mm -hmm. dressed as well. I... I guess I did. I'm <laughs> yeah. a warden yeah. Zuma. Yep. I'm appropriately dressed somehow. Well, very nice. Very nice. We're going to do this party down in the vault. I've got some party favors and things, so follow me. Come on in. In the center here. Oh, oh, there, oh and, 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 there's always one. There's always one casualty. I think I'm a joker. Oh, oh just boy. still on the ground. I cannot tell them when I'm dying. <laughs> well, the party can't start until Cleo respawns. Let me He's kill him. my friend. I can kill him. The party just started and B-Dubs has already made friends. That's about right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, we want him gone, yes? Yes, he can be no. gone. He's just demonstrating how musical boats works. 
That's nice. nice. I see, I see. We'll get to that in just a second. I just want to get you guys over here. There's there's a free cake. There's uh, refreshments Ooh. here. Feel free to mm, take some, some cookies. Oh, oh man! Oh, oh. what type of stew? I'll take your cookies. Have cookies. Oh, cookies. cookies. Listen, have at it. Have at it. And uh, also, also, since this is a, a Zuma themed party, I thought maybe we could start things off by maybe doing our our best Zuma impersonations. So, oh, I, I got one. I got I'll, one. Go ahead, Jeff. Hey everybody, welcome to my tutorial. Oh, <laughs> tutorial. 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 That's perfect. I got one too. Hello, YouTube, and welcome to the first episode of Azuma's oh, World. I'm Azuma. Oh, Nailed it! Nailed it! Who else got some? Go, go ahead. Anyone else? No. Come on, guys. There's got to be more. <laughs> all right, all right. We'll move on. Hello, this is Azuma here. I'm on the BBC wow. for some reason tonight. Whoa. Wow. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, Perfect Joe. accent, Joe. I, mean, <laughs> yeah, I think it was. It, it was. All right. So it uh, can't be a party unless we have some party games. So as you notice, I've set out some boats. They've got a chest in it, which means there's only one actual spot in the boat. And we're going to place like musical chairs. You guys are all familiar with that game, right? Basically, uh, yeah. I'm going to play some music, and when the music stops, you need to pick a boat. Let's all kind of go around maybe clockwise, so this direction. Uh, okay. Now, I will tell you, there's more hermits than boats, so if you uh, can't find a boat when the music stops, you're out. And just feel free to join me here in the center. And I brought some special music for this, so everybody ready to go oh. around counterclockwise? Whoa. Let's do it. Okay, okay. let's do uh, it. Until the music stops. Sorry, clockwise, clockwise. Clockwise! Clockwise! Find a boat. Music stopped! Music stopped! Find a boat! Find a boat! I'm in! Oh man! Who's out? It's not our boat! There's one left! Alright. Tango Falls, Jeb, you're out. Alright, everybody exit the boats. We're now the Satazuma group. We're gonna take a couple votes out of the mix no. here. All oh right. Boy. Okay. okay, we'll take this one too. All right, here we go. Round two. I'm just gonna eat more cake. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Round and round we go. What's the point of this? Yeah, that's on purpose. Uh -huh. That's how the game is And pick a boat. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, oh cool. no, you got so I lucky. Got one. I know. Oh, I'm not going to get one. I'm out. I'm out. No vote for Joe. No vote for Cub. You guys are out. All right. Let's take a couple more votes out of the mix. By the way, there's a great prize for the winner. Just so, just so oh, you know. A great right prize. Down. So you do want to win. Send, bud. Ooh, All right. Here we go. Friend. Round three. My money's on green. Look at him move over there, dude. Look at him move. Green's got speed, bro. And stop. Oh, no. Next round starting now. Watch out, Corrales. Go, Corrales, go, Corrales, go, go, go. Better hurry. Stop. Oh, no. No. Who's left? Azuma and Green. Cheater! <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're down to we're down to one boat. Now oh don't God. just don't just camp the one boat, you two. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, cheaters. At least go around the outside of it or something. Here we go, last round. Can they cut the middle? No, 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 no. Like they're going, they're going all the whole path around. Dude, you better, you better the run, whole path you better I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. I don't want to know who's closer. And stop! Oh, oh, no. No. oh no. no! I got it! I'm good! I got a boat! <laughs> seems a little sus, bud. All right. Very nicely yeah. done. Azuma, this, it's fitting that you, you won at your own costume no, contest. It, yeah. it really it feels like it's my birthday now. And what's even <laughs> more <laughs> fitting... Can I get a prize? Wait, I gotta find the right Azuma here. Okay. What's more fitting is your prize. <laughs> and where are you in Pulse? Oh, the hat, the hat. <laughs> yeah, that does How do you even know? I know. <laughs> of course, it's fitting that you won a shard. The royal quest oh, wow. shard for no, this exact quest, this party that we're throwing. Like wow. he needs any more. Nice. He's got like a million points. <laughs> and even I've been working so hard at getting these. I didn't even realize yeah. that was the prize. That's amazing. <laughs> oh. Even oh, better oh, no. yet. Oh. oh no. Oh, there's one more. There's one more. There's one more. A okay. coupon. 
for iBuy, which Ooh. is the name of my new mega shop. So wow, fifty wow. percent off all season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We got some more games, but if anybody wants to take any party favors back here, go ahead, feel free. Oh, oh they're right. Oh, there's, yeah, yeah. there's some party favors. Oh, wow, there's hey. diamonds in here. Oh. Yep. Oh, Wait a yeah. second. Oh, oh, hey. I, got one. Oh. I got one. Yep. Hey, this is the last this whole way, y'all. Oh, well, to the king's here. Who's Ren! The king's We're down here! Oh. Excuse me! Oh. Whoa. No, 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 no! What is here? Jesus! Um, oh, oh, oh! What? Excuse me! If Pulse. I did this guys, one. Wait, guys, I have more They were giving away diamonds. Oh. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go now. B double O, how could you let this happen? I I thought it was all fun and games until we came over here. Well, I'd say that went well. <laughs> that was fun. Uh, and that means we do earn, well, the diamonds. We gave away the shard there to Azuma, which was well earned in winning the game of musical boats. That was fun. But we got some diamonds out of that. So nice 68 diamonds there. And oh, yeah, there's another piece of business I almost forgot about. Our priority adventure. That's right. We claimed this. And what was the deal here? It said, ask Grumbot what to do. All right. So let's go see what this is about. We'll go over and visit Grumbot. And of course, we're going to need to have a piece of paper that asks a question. I think that's how Grumbot works, if I remember. And there he is. Amazing. Just the last episode, I was in here and I really wanted to test this thing out. And now I've literally got a royal adventure to <laughs> telling me that that's exactly what I need to be doing. All right, so I think this works by putting the piece of paper in this chest, and then we press this button, and he's gonna tell us what to do. Oh, this is so exciting. Bing, 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 and oh, there he goes. Does that mean he's got a, here it is. And father one wants you to hit generate content. Father one, <laughs> is that what you're calling yourself? I thought you were Grumbot, okay. So he wants us to use the content generator again? We just did that. <laughs> it led to a pretty fun party, though. All right, I'm down. I suppose that means I have to pay another five diamonds, but I think this is going to be worth it. Five diamonds in. All right, let's see what it says. Boop, 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 boop. Here we go. First paper says remove. Second one says king. Third one, claim. Remove king claim. R remove the king's claim to the throne? Is that, is that what that means? Do you guys think, think that means? Remove king claim. I mean, that's the message I'm getting here, which is fine by me because I'm still not happy about him trying to take over all my shops. What do you guys think? I'll definitely be thinking about this one. Between episodes, that's right. We have reached the end of this episode. Let me know what you guys think, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I had a super fun time, and also that means I've officially got another King's Quest done for wearing this dunce cap all episode long. So, got more diamonds to collect, and possibly a king to overthrow? <laughs> this is getting exciting. All right, you guys know what to do. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do that before you go. And with that said, I'll see you again next time. Have a good one, everyone.